Hello and welcome to the Windows 12 update news. Yes, I have started a new series where I'm going to talk about the Windows 12 updates and everything. And I have also made a playlist for Windows 12 update. Although Microsoft hasn't confirmed what the next Windows is going to be called, everybody is saying that it is the Windows 12. So we're just going to go with the Windows 12. And you know, Microsoft is cooking something. If you don't know, don't worry. Uh, this video is about that. What is cooking? in the Microsoft's kitchen <laughs> and also I miss my mustache and beard damn look at me I look so handsome in those okay on to the real thing now so we have a huge news on Windows 12 according to Windows Central Microsoft is planning to make Windows 12 modern and it looks like the project name for the Windows 12 is called core pc there was a core os project 2 which was a code name for windows 10x if you remember windows 10x then you also know that windows 10x was a operating system which would only use the uwp apps the entire operating system was using the uwp design and apps here is a quick example difference between uwp and the classic win32 apps the control panel it's a legacy classic uh, application in windows but the new settings app in windows is uwp app the modern thingy yeah <laughs> yeah i call it a thingy <laughs> so basically windows 10x didn't had a control panel or any legacy apps it was all modern operating system but sadly it never came out to the public <laughs> we had some demos uh, of windows 10x but it just died no one ever actually got to try out the windows 10x so it's a dead operating system now with the windows 12 they are trying to do the same thing they did with the windows 10x they are trying to make entire operating system a uwp first os which means many legacy apps such as control panel will be gone forever and another good thing about windows 12 is that it is going to support legacy apps natively windows 10x didn't support legacy apps natively uh, they were working on some type of layer compatibility layer but you know windows 10x is dead so we never got to know everything about windows 10x one of the biggest change in windows 12 is going to be that it is going to have a multiple partitions for uh, the user data apps and the entire operating system itself so here we have a example screenshot made by the windows central so you can see we have multiple partitions we have the main os where only the operating system is installed here and the os data is in different place uh, there is going to be user data partition one of the biggest benefit of having a different partition is that updates can be installed faster and operating system itself can be more secure so currently the windows that we are using has only one partition and everything is in one place the entire operating system the system apps the user apps are there so having a multiple partitions is actually a good thing and i think microsoft is finally going to do this hopefully it doesn't fail this time so yeah uh, this is uh, going to be a one of the biggest change in entire like history of windows and i'm actually excited for this version of windows and hopefully you know as i said again microsoft won't fail this time just like they did with the windows 10x yeah <laughs> and it is probably going to get released in 2024 uh, after one year if everything goes well maybe they will release a preview builds the beta builds early in late 2023 so i think that's it for this windows 12 update news if there is anything new in the future i'll make another update news if you're also excited for windows 12 maybe just follow me and you know we're gonna keep track of the windows 12 together yeah <laughs> so i think that's it hope you enjoyed it if you have any questions or have any suggestions for me you can always do the comment and yeah we can have some chit chat in the comment section too yeah that's it i will see you in the next one take care yourself and have fun bye bye